Scrum is an empirical approach to solve complex problems in complex environments. Alastair Coburn coined it well. We work for a client who does not yet already know what they want in a technology we not yet really understand in an environment which is changing. For that reason, it doesn't make sense to specify all the scope in the beginning. Therefore, we cannot be driven by activity where we plan everything, then we analyze everything we planned, then we design everything we analyzed, then we implement everything we designed, then we test everything we implemented, and finally we release everything we tested. Now, by being activity-driven, the batch size is the whole product, and we only learn at the very end after a very long time. Often there is even a lesson learned workshop prescribed at the end. Sometimes it's called a postmortem. That is not helpful. Often too late in my opinion and usually also very expensive. Instead of learning once, we want to learn continuously. This is why we work in sprints. Every sprint allows us to inspect and learn and immediately apply the learned in the upcoming sprints. Lessons learning instead of lessons learned. Now we can work value-driven, guided by customer outcome, and not activity-driven because we have a cross-functional team which allows us to take care of all those activities. Actually, the cross-functional team, the vertical slicing of the requirements are the enabling constraints in our complex environment. But there is more. Classical requirement engineering is the codification of knowledge. We swap our understanding into a document, which can be read six months later to recreate the state of knowledge. Since our language is not context-free, it is a futile approach. There will always be misunderstandings. Instead of adding more and more rules to our specification language, how about we increase our levels of interactions and communication. Give everyone the chance to ask all the questions they have in order to clarify their understanding. Once the developers have no more questions, they are ready. It is more about talking and less about writing more. Ron Jeffries described this really well with his approach of the three C's. Card, conversation, confirmation. I like to think about refinement as lean requirements engineering, just in time with no waste.